My office at work has a lot of technical people in it and they will occasionally come and ask me about the lights. You know, how do they work? What does it take to get them going? And so it's usually a conversation about the capabilities of the lights or things that you need to get started. So it's a lot of technical information that I generally give when somebody asks me a question like that. And so I was talking to a guy at work and, and you know, we went through all that and his response was, oh, I, I don't care about all that. And so my response was, you don't what? And he said, no, no, I, I don't care about all that stuff. And I'm like, and he said, no, 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 no. I, I, I mean, it's cool that that does all that stuff, but all I want is some lights to decorate my patio. Maybe if I have some people over or if I'm just chilling out at night. So if you're just interested in decorating your patio or maybe you want to put some lights on a boat or maybe you have just recently acquired a military Humvee and you're driving your Humvee in your town's parade and you want to decorate it with some lights. If you're Uber Christmas or if you just want some decoration, this episode is the one for you. Hi, welcome to Kenneth Spader Christmas. I'm kind of excited to show you something today. So this is a pixel tester from Hanson Electronics. They sponsor this video. Um, you connect 12 volts up to here, you connect pixels up to here, and it runs your pixels. So if you're, you know, if you have thousands of pixels and you just want to test a, a string of 100, you can just hook it straight up to here. If you're just doing uh, pixels on your patio or your DJ booth or your car or your boat, um, you can hook up 100 pixels to this, apply power here, and you're good to go. You can change. There's three little buttons on the back here. I don't know if you can see them or not. Uh, the center one is to change the speed. Uh, these other two are to switch the mode up and down. There's 76 modes. This thing can handle 2048 pixels. It's a controller that you don't need to program. It just runs a chase pattern and I'll show you that in just a second. Uh, if you're running more than 100 pixels though, you need to do power injection and I'm not gonna show you how to do that in this video. Most of you, 100 pixels would be plenty. So let's take a look. This is a hex fuse from Hanson Electronics. It's a uh, six way fused power breakout. It's got three isolated inputs to three pairs of two fused outputs. So in other words, you can come in with three 30 amp inputs and you've got six 15 amp outputs. They just use regular automotive ATO fuses and if a fuse is blown or missing, you will get a little LED indication. The setup that we have is I have a 12 volt power supply, AC power coming into the power supply. Um, I've got all three of these hooked up to this hex fuse but you only need one so this center one is the one that we're using it's coming through this fuse and coming out here to this controller the other side is just this negative lead coming out through this alligator clip to the negative side of the controller out of the controller i just connected a pigtail that i have on all of my uh, pixels just to make it easier to connect them up. You don't necessarily need this. You could probably just use this, this kind of connector. All right, this is the tester that's running 100 pixels and it is at its slowest setting. So this is number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So there's nine different settings. Let's get this back up. And then it has 76 different patterns. So I'll just start running through them here. I won't go through all of them because it take too long but just to give you an idea mm -hmm. 
if you're just doing these to uh, to for some decorative lighting then you're bound to find something that you like if you're doing these to test your pixels uh, something that shows all the colors is probably fine I want to thank Alan at Hanson Electronics for sponsoring this video and for sending me this cool little device. I'm sure I can get a lot of use out of it. I'll link to his website in the description below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. And all the dogs run. There's so many cars going back.